Welcome back to the channel, man. Here with my homie T Mill. Y'all might have seen him before on my channel. We about to do a, a a different kind of reaction to the pop the balloon. So like, we see a lot of chicks coming out on the show and a lot of guys that don't be knowing what to look for or they be missing certain red flags. Mm -hmm. So we just want to discuss, yeah, or rate, or from our viewpoint, from our viewpoint, yeah, things you should look for. Like, so pop the balloon is very very synonymous with real life yeah as far as like what chicks is looking for yep and what you should be looking out for when yep. it comes to these chicks like it's very synonymous like it's parallel to real life so we just want to do some reactions and, and some uh some things to look out for from our perspective with the women that come out and then hopefully you can learn something and take away from it and avoid you know i mean making the mistakes you were about to see all these yeah. guys make on there avoid the booger woods and man. then also for the women this is how men talk. This is how men talk. So this is how men if think. we're at a bar, this is how we will be talking. Just you know. <laughs> and women, I mean, you can take it for a grain of salt if you want to, but if you come in, this is probably what's being said at that bar. Facts. With you know two men that Facts. are looking at you because I mean, Facts. you know, you know. Yo, the, the a woman's first impression when she walk in or anywhere, yeah, this is pretty much what what dudes yeah. are saying. Thousand think. percent. So. Yep. Uh, let's get into it. We're going to start like the middle of the video. Let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hey. Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? I'm right. Paige. First impression. Okay, first impression. <clears throat> she is thick. She thick as hell. Ooh, she's thick. This is frozen peanut butter. Bro, I'm saying. Like. All right, man. <sighs> this about to. Ooh, this she about is thick. to. <laughs> no. When you see a thick chick, bro, where does your mind go? Where does your mind go? Cooking. I am, I'm so serious, bro. Really? Like, I, if you think I see thick a, chicks can cook? Yeah, I do. Depending on the build. Depends. <laughs> if, it, if you're talking about BBL thick, yeah. then nah, I'm thinking you probably don't cook. Yeah. Okay. But a woman like her, depending on, of course, then you get to peel the layers back where she's from, yeah. her age, all the other stuff, and then you get to feel your, all right, maybe she can or can't take care of yeah. the household. But when I first see a thick woman like that, with that type of like stallion structure, mm -hmm. I'm thinking down south cooking. I could see that. I could see that. That's not where my mind go at all. Where does yours go? <laughs> Dare you say? Mounting. That's what <laughs> Are you keeping that? Please keep that shit. <laughs> oh my god. You see that one? Oh. Uh, all right, man. Let's oh, see what she's talking about. Mounting. <laughs> Off of that one. First impression, she just walked out. Are you popping your balloon? Obviously not. Uh, no, I'm not popping my balloon. Why? Because nope. she thick. Uh, that's, okay. yeah, that's, about, that's about it. But honestly, from what I can see so far, yeah, I wouldn't pop immediately, but I I, I think I would know I'm going to pop at some point before yeah. she leaves. I don't think I'll be keeping the my balloon. The first sign of a red flag, I'm popping. Right? Yeah, it'll be yeah. easy to pop my balloon yes. if you say the wrong thing. Some of them, it's like, all right, I'm going to hear you out, and I'm going to look past it. Exactly. But with her, yeah. it's like, I'm not looking past she that. She walk, she, she walking the fine line. I'm not into the to the, to the the hairstyle. She got the, like, the excessive big weaves and wigs or whatever that is. I ain't yeah. really into that stuff. Um, and even, like, thicker chicks, like, you can still tell a thick chick who, like, Work out, work out, and body. take care of her body yeah. versus a thick chick who's just still young yes. and hasn't hit that part of life. Where and then you get to figure out that when she starts talking, because then you're going to see her age. If exactly. she got kids, exactly. all those play a factor yep. in it. If yeah. she's this thick yeah. and she's younger, I'm going to be able to probably guess like she probably don't work out like that. She just blessed Safe. with a great body. Safe bet. Yeah. 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 A student in a health science program. Okay. Now, what are some things you like to do for fun? I'm very adventurous, so I like outdoors, nature, luxury experiences, okay. traveling. All right. Yeah. <laughs> now, what are some things you look for in a man? I look for amazing communication, okay. God-fearing, mm. hardworking. That's about it. <laughs> All right. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? No personality, mm. no accountability, no reliability. That's about it. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So we. She, but she also gave the most cliche answers. They feel very rehearsed. They do. They feel like because you know what you're gonna be asked when you go on the you show. Know. So it's like, all right, I know what. These are the ones that I'm really gonna get. Yeah, them. yeah. these are gonna make me look. Yeah, but look again, as good as possible. Yeah. I'm so cold with it. You know. Oh, I'm sorry, channel. <laughs> <laughs> but no, for real, like I'm not saying that that's not her. Like that could that could be that well could be her. her. That could be her. She's she probably go to church. She kind of still give like 
typical. You yeah. know, like if I yeah. had to bet, if she's gonna be different from the rest or more similar more to similar. the rest, more similar. I'm gonna say she's more. Similar that was basic. Rest. Basic answer is basic. Exactly. But I'm gonna steal her. I wouldn't pop my balloon. I'm not. I, I haven't popped my balloon yet. I wouldn't nope. pop my balloon. All right. Let's see. We're just doing first impressions. First impressions on, on what we see when she. When comes a woman out. comes out, if we will pop the balloon when she comes out, a, and then b when she talks, introduces herself, says her age, all the other stuff. If then we will pop, or why we may or may not pop because of what she said. Exactly. So those are going to be the things that we're looking at, which is what men look for in the well, first place. Yeah. By the time really you do. started speaking and all that, we got a general idea of... If Just like women do. Yeah. They know if they're going to, um, you know, go all the way with a man in the first, what, 30 seconds of talking to him or something, something like that. Yeah. So we know if we're going to pop our balloon, if Very we're looking certain. at actual, for commitment though. This is looking right, for right, commitment. This right. ain't looking for just that night. Hello. Welcome in. What's your name? Samaya. Samaya, how old are you? I'm 25. And what do you do? I'm a licensed AMA. <sighs> Sorry. We were supposed to say if we pop immediately. Okay, off first impression off the walkout. I'm popping. I'm I'm popping. She's beautiful. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bro, I'm she popping looks just because like... of how slender she is. Yeah. I don't care for that super slender figure. Yeah. Anymore in my life. I had a time where, and also you got to think like, because immediately what we think of when we see women, mm -hmm. we're also thinking of sexually. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm, I, I hate to say it, but it's, no, the, it's the honest guy's it. truth. It is, yeah. it is the truth. Yeah. I have to be able to imagine myself with her in that bedroom. Yeah. Me at, you know, 5'10", 5'11", 210, and her at whatever her height is, 5'6", 5'7". Like 10 as well. In about a buck 20, buck 30. Yeah. I also have to think about that dynamic as well because yeah. I'm a bigger person. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, but she, she's, she looks like she might be pretty. She, she don't can't really tell. In the hairstyle. She's, she has a hairstyle that's kind of taken away from it's her face. Covering her face. Yeah. So it's like, if I, if she had her hair pulled back or something like that, yeah. or even if she comes out and then she puts it behind her ear, which women do, then I could get a better gauge on, all right, the physique might be slender, right. but you got a really pretty. But you got a really pretty. So, yeah. like, I'm not trying to just disregard like the that's why it's hard for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Tyler, it's yeah. hard for me to say. If, I'm gonna just say right now, I'm gonna hold my balloon. No, you wouldn't. I, I am. I Bro, am. no, you're not. Because, because I don't, I can't tell how pretty she is. Because, like you said, the hair kind of covering her face. So that's exactly why I'm popping. And then, well, I'm just saying, like, if I could see see her face more, if we watch a little bit more of this, I'd oh, yeah. better. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm still popping. But, yeah, the, the, the build. Yeah. See, because this is how I think, though. Yeah. If you are looking for, like, long-term commitment and all that stuff. Put some size on her. You can put some size on yeah. her. And if you're a guy that wants to have kids, if you're a guy that want to have kids, a slender chick, she got a lot more room to grow. That is true. Versus the thicker chick. Yeah, it only true. goes up from here. Their metabolism slows down as they age. Yep. They have kids. They're going to put on childbearing like, oh, hips. Yeah, yeah. They so don't go down. If yeah. I'm thinking like that, yeah. longevity. Yeah, y'all want to start with a chick with a smaller frame because she's <sighs> only going to get bigger. I'm after also going to pop too. She's standing next to Arlette, which makes her look like an even smaller. Oh one. yeah, I don't mean yeah. like Arlette. Like, I think you're saying something. No, 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 yeah, no, no, no. Okay. Arlette, no. But she <laughs> she has you know she stands next exactly. to a like thicker woman that yeah. has more of the build that I would exactly. like. Exactly. So I'm also gonna pop in because I'm comparing you next to the only other female yeah, around yeah. here. So like nah. Yeah. That, nah. Now that you said because I wasn't even looking at her left standing right there. Yeah, she looks make her look much even. Smaller. She looked like a part of the like backdrop, <laughs> don't she? Like if she was <laughs> right in the middle, like she could line slab. up. Yeah, she looked like a slab, bro. <laughs> Let's keep watching. Okay, nice. Uh, what are some things you like to do for fun? I like to go on hikes and I like to go to the gym. Okay. I don't like how Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, someone who has boundaries, someone who knows what they want. Um, I'm thankful I, I popped early. I hate how she talks. I'm thankful I popped early. Yeah, I, I'm at this point, I'll pop. You'll pop your book? I'll pop. Yeah, I'll pop yeah, at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no. Someone. Yeah. <laughs> now, what are some of your deal breakers? Um, someone who's a liar, someone who doesn't know how to communicate. Bro, yeah, <laughs> I'm popping. She's cute. Though. All right, so she we cute. now that she turned problems. to the camera, so she's 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 cute. She's very cute. You, so let me hand you a pic. I, she would drive me crazy talking like that. Yeah, cause you gotta talk to her. Like, eh, like she so if she talk ditzy. like that outside in the bedroom, bro. Yeah. Come on, man. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry, sweetheart. I'm sorry. She's cute, though. She is cute. She is cute. She is cute. And I know a lot of people say that on the show. Because I mean, you you say your face like yeah, I pop my balloon, but you pretty though. Yeah. But like she actually is. She's she has actually a cute pretty. Face. Yeah. yeah. She don't need to hide her face. She don't need to hide her face at all. Showcase your face. All right, let's do one more. You don't want to skip this one. We're coming on. Let's give it up for wow. her guys. <laughs> my mama said if I ain't got nothing good to say. <laughs> we about to see. And yeah, she went empty. Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Lou, welcome in. What's your name? Imaya. Imaya, how old are you? I'm 24. And what do you do? I'm what are we not, doing with Imaya? I'm not popping. I'm not popping my balloon. You know who Imaya look like? Medusa? Because <laughs> of the hairstyle? She look like Kaya. A little bit. Like a, a, little bit. a slimmer Yeah, a little bit. I Kaya. can see it. Yeah. It's the same My neck, my back. Yeah. Skin complexion. I can see it. She kind of give young Kaya. Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next she really single do. I lady. Even, I thought you were going to say Medusa hairstyle, but yeah, she do. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Imaya. Imaya, how old are you? I'm 24. And what do you do? I'm popping. Um, why? Because of the shoes? I'm not, a, I'm not a fan of the hand tat she got going on. I'm not a fan of that. I'm definitely not a fan of the yeah. middle of the titty tats. Unless it's Rihanna. Oh, I love them. Unless it's Rihanna. What about Eve? Eve had the paw prints. She no. kind of started. Eve... Paw prints were on the titties. I said oh, the like middle, the middle, crease. like right here, like in and underneath. Yeah. No, not in and underneath. Oh, just in the middle. Just in the middle. Oh, okay. Because the under boob, that's fire. That's real. Especially if you got little Love ones. Love that. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I'm talking right here. I'm not popping, but I don't like the arm tat, and I'm not opposed to tattoos. Yeah, but they can't look like prison tats. Or yeah, it can't look I, I, like I'm still not popping off the hand tattoo though. I you got just, you. you just. This is. Well, again, we talking. The last one I said I popped, so I'm not just. Looking are you for thinking it. longevity, or are you thinking what you're thinking? I'm thinking I'm gonna hear her out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna hear her out, bro. Oh, nice. Uh, what are some things I like to do for fun? Um, I like to um, garden. I like to cook. Um, I like to do like beauty things. I like to do my nails, hair, makeup. Yeah, I'm, I'm not popping. That's about it. Okay. <laughs> now, what are some I'm things you look guy. for in a man? Um. I look for a gentleman, somebody that actually wants to be a man. Um, consistency. She's mature. No, she's not. She's mature, bro. I'm gonna tell you why. She's mature. I'm gonna tell you why, bro. See, he's not as he's not as well seasoned and and shit as good as I am. Shit. A woman that says mm -hmm. I'm looking for a man that wants to be a man. Yeah. She's tired of dealing with boys. Whose fault is that? Hers. It sounds like she has a, a, a bad a judge of character. For sure. And then also, for heterosexual men, that's what I'm assuming she would be looking for. I would hope so. What heterosexual men are out here saying, I don't want to be a man? It's not them saying it. Probably what they're showing, though. But that's my point. Yeah. Like, even if that's what they're showing, yeah. I don't think no heterosexual But she said one of her hobbies, and this is what got me, was <laughs> gardening, bro. You are mature. You like hoes. <laughs> yeah, I, I love hoes. I love playing with hoes. The use of hoes is something about it. It do something for me. Garden is, it, and I like a, that color on her skin. I, no, 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 that I color agree. is fire on her skin. I yeah, agree. bro. I yeah. agree. I yeah. agree. Yeah, I'm holding on to balloon. I'm gonna let you have this one. Okay. Um, Thank you. Someone that's not a liar. Mm. That's okay. She damaged, bro. She damaged. Who ain't? She damaged in a sense of like. I feel like she already has a preconceived notion when she. I don't do that when I meet new women. Like, oh, like think of like who they are already before. Yeah, like women mm -hmm. are liars. Well, we'd have women. to watch this whole episode to see and break down. Like, if she just comes out like pop, pop, pop because oh, you look like you mm -hmm. are this and stuff yeah. like that. We'd have to watch all of it. Let's wanna, do one more woman. I want a one man that wants to be a man, and I don't want a liar. These just sounds like Bro, she's projecting. If I'm going on the show and Arlette's like, what are you? What are you looking for? If I said I want a woman that acts like a woman, no, she didn't. She said I want a man that wants to be a man. You're not going to say I want a woman that want to be a woman. I mean, because that would sound crazy. I mean, I do want a woman that wants to be a woman. <laughs> right? Would you say that? She better be a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me after I didn't pop your balloon. <sighs> you post out. All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Anissa. No one's popping. And I'm included in that no one's popping a balloon. I'm not popping my balloon. Is bro. she not 
Is she not the same build as the other slim chick from two girls ago that you said? It's her. It's how she's shown it, though. You see what I'm saying? The other girl came out with <laughs> No, it makes sense, though, bro. a horn dog. It, no, it's not a horn dog. This is what she's it's, showing, it's, though. Because you have to, in men, this is for y'all, too. You have to wear stuff that is flattering to your physique, right? Yeah. So, old girl that was super slender came out in, like, that sleeveless like garment. vest yeah, yeah, yeah. so I'm like alright I can see you're of a thinner shape yeah. she comes out in like a more fitted brown dress on yeah. that brown skin yeah with the with the wrap with they the, could be the same height and weight, and weight but yeah. she's looking better because right. she's not showing oh I'm just skin and bones you know yeah. what I'm saying no, I'm bad. not popping my balloon off her. me either yeah. me either yeah. not yet and no they're not the same size look at that lower half Anissa, Anissa how old are you I'm 23 okay and what do you do so I'm a cosmet a licensed cosmetologist. I do hair and I do makeup. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. And popping out. Fellas, these are all red flags. <laughs> <laughs> no, I knew you was popping. I knew you were popping. I'm a cosmetologist. I, I'm a hairstylist yep. and I do makeup. Bro, these are all red flags, bro. You don't have to you don't have to listen to me. You don't have to. You don't. I would advise you to, but you don't. She she gave you she hit you with a triple threat. The I'm trifecta. Not, I'm still not me either. But I'm saying, <laughs> you like? I said these are red flags. Oh, okay. That's what I, said. Okay. I didn't say I was popping. Not a big enough red flag for but you to pop your balloon. I just know what I'm about to deal with. If, oh, yeah, for if sure. I know sure. what I'm getting myself into, I know how to approach it, I know how to handle it. But yeah. I know this is a walking red flag. Yeah. Don't ask me how I know this. Don't ask me why I know this. I won't. Don't ask me, well, what is it about a girl that does hair, I'm, makeup, and a cosmetologist that makes I'm her not, a red flag? I'm not going to say anything. I'm not going to ask. You're either going to take my advice or you're not. And I agree with you 100%. I've been there and done it. I know. Cool. And what are some things I could do for fun? So, um, I like to just try new things. Like, I love to, like, go to, like, museums. I love to, like, just try new things. Like, just, like, go out. She talks with her hands, mm -hmm. which most women in these professions do. Yes, they do. I'm sorry to stereotype, but it is what it is. It's, it's, she's talking stereotypically. Literally. Like, like that. Literally. Like, I like to do this. I like to do She's that. She's giving like what do they would yeah. give. Yeah, she like, is. She is. But I'm, still, I'm still not popping. Still haven't popped my balloon. Still haven't popped my balloon. Yeah, still holding yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you know, that's it. Just okay. Think, yeah. <laughs> I'm very adventurous, so. Got it. Mm -hmm. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Someone who is very respectful. Like, that's my main thing. Like, respectful. She's from New York. Yeah. Um, Kind-hearted, because I feel like I'm a really good person. Like, mm -hmm. I feel like I'm a kind person. Someone who is nice, you know, kind and everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. What are some deal breakers? Mm -hmm. Um... I wouldn't say it's a deal breaker, but I would prefer someone who doesn't have kids because I don't have kids. Okay, so that's but it's like I could work. I'm I love still kids, not so I could work with it, but that's a father, one of my I'm things. Um, someone who is disrespectful, like if you disrespectful, <laughs> if you don't have respect for women, then that's my biggest deal breaker. Like I don't like that. Like oh, you know, that's it. That accent, bro. <laughs> yeah. I'm not popping my balloon. Right, so I'm going to deal with those red flags right now. Being so from New York as a woman is a red flag. I'm not going to say that. There She's going to leave this show and, and throw her Tim's on. You pop three she, balloons. Well, I'm wearing three. Tim's right now, bro. <laughs> Who's not really a <laughs> yeah, usual Tim's type? Couple. Whatever it is, whatever you're not feeling, go ahead and pop those three. Okay. All right, yeah, I'm not popping. I'm not popping my balloon. Sorry, I'm sorry. He took his uh yeah what is it the braids off. no he took the jacket off yeah he did because he probably got roasted so much <laughs> that he was just like you know what if i'm gonna have any chance of leaving with something yeah let me take this stupid ass coat off yeah yeah all right man i hope y'all was able to pick up on some of the stuff we said man like hopefully hopefully, hopefully. we have i what i know we have a decent enough amount of experience yes to be able to just gauge certain things off of a very short yeah. You know, yeah. short interaction. Yeah, a couple minutes, if that. If you've been doing something for long enough, it don't take that long. Like, I know yeah. chefs who can whip up an amazing meal in like five, 10 minutes. Yeah. It's like, bro, how you make it? tastes so good. How you make it so quick? It's just, yeah. you've been doing something for long enough. You just know how to do it. You know you how to do it. it. Like, yeah. so, but be mindful when you are actually dating for real, like outside of the Papa Balloon show. Like, when you are actually dating for real, you do want to look for certain signs and certain cues. Uh, when you're trying to determine if it's somebody I'm about to date seriously or if it's somebody I'm about to just, you know, have fun with it, keep it pushing. But yeah, these are just some of the things that, you know, we discuss as men and we see First about impressions. First, First impressions. First impressions, man. First impressions. First impressions. So, yeah. uh, anything to say before we get up under? Nah, man. I just, I wouldn't pop for that last one. I, I just want to reiterate that for the camera. I wouldn't pop. I bet I find you in her likes. You won't. <laughs> DMs don't show up for public. <laughs> we got more videos on the way, man. Hit the like, subscribe, share button, all that good stuff. And I'm going to get back with y'all soon, man. Peace.